Hello everyone, this is Automate Sheet and my name is Lokesh and thanks for coming here. Hello friends, today I'm going to show you a tool which is basically work allocation tool and it basically creates a different sheet based on your filter. So whatever a column you select based on that it extracts the unique values from that particular column and based on those value it creates a different sheet. So let's start our video. So before showing you the code I am going to show you the demo of this particular tool. You can see that these are my range and it has 4 headers. Now I click on the create button. Once you click on the create button it is going to show you the box. Please select any cell in the range. So you can select any cell in your range. After selecting the cell press click on the ok button. Once you click on the ok button it is going to show you. It is going to ask you what is your criteria. So I am going to select the region as a criteria here. Once you select this click on the submit button you notice that there is only one sheet but after clicking the button there are four different sheets first is the north you can see some data here again second is the east and again there is some data same goes for south and west so if you combine the uh, data for this four sheet you notice that this is exactly same data we have on our first sheet so this is the way it basically creates a different uh, unique sheets based on your filter if I apply the filter, show you the reason, you can see there are four values there. So these are the four sheets based on those four values. After doing this, you can also delete this sheet with the help of the button. If you click on the button, this way. So basically you can create a delete a sheet if there are two, three or four easily by selecting them and deleting in one go. But suppose if let's show you another example if you click on again the create button select the range now you select the serial number click on submit you can see there are lots of sheets so you cannot select them in one go or if you can select them this is kind of hard work you need to do it like this way so instead of doing this go back our main sheet and just press this button and the sheets are gone now you can see button in the green color which says data entry if you click over it you can see a user form and this is not the user form I have created in the VBA this is basically Excel's inbuilt user form and here you can edit the record create a new record and delete the record so if you see that in the tenth serial number there is a north you just need to press on the criteria type the 10 and if you press the enter you will have the information of 10th row and here you can change anything you can change north to west easily and after this you just need to press the enter and you can also cycle through all the records just by clicking the enter button so this is quite helpful and this is quite dynamic so now you can see that there are four fields if you close this and delete this column D this way now you again click on the button you see there are only three input box sorry three text box where you can uh, input the information I go up back again to the sheet press the control Z and again click on this button now there are again the four information you can put in this box so this is dynamic now I'm going to show you the code this is my code and here I have declared the variables and here I am taking the sheet as an object sheet name is data and this is my range which basically user select after coming the uh, input box and here I am showing the using the uh, user form you can see that here user basically input or select the criteria and after the criteria based on that particular column it fetches all the unique values here and after fetching all the unique values it's basically create a sheet based on all the unique values and also paste the data in different sheets and here I am closing my code and releasing memory so it is quite easy and there are other subs I am using this is the delete sheet code and this is the data entry code so it's not uh, quite complex it's quite easy to understand so there is another method to achieve same kind of result using the pivot table you can see pivot table on the right 
if you click over it go to the analyze and check the source data this is the same range we were using with the tool after that you can go to the field list and the field list you can show in the rows there is a serial number name and the work order and the in filter it has the region you must enter your criteria in the filter if you don't enter it it is not going to work after this you again go to the analyze tab go to the option and go to the second option this is not the right go to the option and click on this drop down and select the second option which says show report filter pages once you click over there it is asking you to select the filter now if you click ok you can see that it has created different sheet based on the filter values now you can copy this range like this way and paste as values and after that you can delete the rows and it work exactly the same way the tool was working so friend why this tool is important because it's a dynamic tool for example if i insert here four or five six column and copy the range here and paste here and click on the create button and select any of the range and just get the uh, filter by the name click on submit so it only works on this particular range so you can select any range for this tool and it works so this is quite dynamic thanks for watching this video and please subscribe my channel and like this video if you have any query suggestion or feedback please write in the comment box thank you